Oh, what is taking him so long? I'm going in. I'm sorry you didn't get those test results, Blondie. I should never have kept a secret from you. From now on, no more secrets. Ever. Oh, yeah? Well, what about Cassandra? That's between uh. her and me. Okay, the truth? You know how I said I just woke up with my hair long? Well, I didn't. The night before, Cass kinda helped me break out of Corona. Oh, I knew it! Oh, she's gonna get in so much trouble! <laughs> That is, of course, if anyone were to find out, which they won't, because this guy is a vault. You should have seen it. It was a crazy night. She showed me these black rocks, and I know it sounds so weird, but I think they're what made my hair grow back. <laughs> Just you and me, Max. Arrivederci, baby. It means goodbye. Huh? Crossbow procedure number one. Always keep the safety on. <laughs> Actually saved by one of the captain's dumb rules. Don't you dare tell him. The last thing I want is to see that guy get a big head. Guards, too? Um. Bastard! This exposition of sciences is spreading our ranks too thin. Pascal? 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 Hello? Come out, buddy! Blondie, are you sure you want to keep... Yes, I'm sure I want to keep looking! Okay, looking! I'm looking, still looking! Rapunzel, I... Hey, Cass, good morning! You look less pale today. Looking for Rapunzel? Yeah, I wouldn't. She's a little upset, so you might want to keep your... Move it, Powder Puff. Ole! Tried to warn you. Raps? Did he turn up? Did you find anything? Did anyone see anything? Is he okay? Uh, no. No word on Pascal. Look, we're going to have to call off the search for now. What are you talking about? I know you're worried about Pascal. We all are. But you have another packed day ahead of you. Listen, Rapunzel. No, you, you listen. Cancel everything. Lock down the castle. Nothing gets done until we find Pascal. Nothing is more important than that. Nothing. Is that clear? I would do what she says. Now that is a game face. <laughs> 
I asked Pete and Stan to stand outside and make sure you got peace and quiet, but I forgot they tend to bicker. Rapunzel, I told you, I don't need... I just wanted to let you know that they have been relieved of duty. Thank you. And replaced with Maximus. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, look who it is! <laughs> Pretty good likeness, huh? Well, if it isn't everyone's favorite example of equine excellence, good morning, Maximus. It's Max! All right! <laughs> Ooh, Max, hey, looking spry and svelte today. <laughs> This were a popularity contest, you would come in first place. Or at least a close second. But I gotta say, Max, that mane is looking great! <laughs> wow. Oh, it's beautiful. I don't recall the last time it snowed this much. Hmm. Looks like there's more to come. I don't know, Ariana. Maybe we should return to the castle. Hmm. Frederick, I know you're worried about Rapunzel. <laughs> but she's going to be... Where are my parents? It looks like there was an accident up on the mountain. Bring them home, Max. How do we get down there? <laughs> we'll have to reach them by taking that ridge. That tiny little thing? You'd sooner find a horse on that ledge before you get me to go on there. <laughs> that is one determined horse. single well-oiled machine. Together, they gather all sorts of varieties. We make buckwheat honey, orange blossom honey, kudzu honey. Oops. Looks like he just got a face full of pheromones. What are those? It's like a love potion for bees. They think they got themselves a new queen. I'm pretty sure that was bee pheromones. 
why is this just sitting here in a drinking glass? <laughs> What the important thing here is uh, uh, that, that people are having fun, yeah, you know, and isn't that the whole point of a Goodwill Festival? And that gopher grab tomorrow is gonna make everything even better, so maybe the two of you should just get together and work it out, huh? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> well, Max, I hope you learned something there. Boy, is it ever frosty between those two. Oh, you're right, I should do something about it. The problem is, when people don't get along, Blondie's the one who normally fixes it, and she usually does it in some unique and artful way. That's it! Max! Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Ha-ha! <laughs> Perfect! Oh, Eugene, you unique and artful devil, you! Are you damaged, Fitzherbert? Well, if by that you mean this is a brilliant way to force you two to work it out, then yes, color me damaged. If not, this was clearly Max's idea. I am so excited to see what you have planned for our date. Don't you worry, your royal blondness. Eugene's got it covered. I've entrusted Max here to seek out and deliver us to the most primo romantic spot around. You'll see. We're talking dinner for two. The stars twinkling above, the works. Now, I'm not saying it'll top our crown-stealing, lantern-watching first date, but I kinda am. Isn't that right, buddy? <laughs> An apple tree! Seriously, that's the best you got? What does frying flu for mean? Pretty sure it means we're pets. Oh, I don't think. So, Hookfoot was in love, and he had his own way of showing it. I'm so nervous, my ears are sweating. Anybody got a rag? Hey, hey, can I use your horsetail? <laughs> I guess that's a nay. <laughs> All right, I'll be down in a minute. You know, Max, there was a time I really wanted to own an island just like that. But now that I've lived there, I think I want a better one. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go below. Hey, would you look at that? This is one of my very first wanted posters. I've been looking for one of these to put in the old scrapbook. <laughs> oh, still sour about never getting your hooves on old Flynn Rider, huh? <laughs> Keep off railing. Seriously? You see, your problem is you're too rigid. You're too stuck on procedure to see the big... Whoa! Oh! oh. Come on, let go of me! Man, you are a stickler. Hey, hey, a little help here! What's that, Yam? Help! Oh, I will help myself. Thank you, kind sir. No, no, no! No, stop! We're down here in the water! Oh, great! Just great! <laughs> oh, 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 this is my fault, huh? Why couldn't you just let me lean on the railing? <laughs> Heaven forbid someone would break a rule. Oh, but don't worry, we're out in the middle of nowhere. Ah, <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, that's our last apple. Then why are you using it for target practice? I use these breaks to stay sharp. Good, stay sharp with your own apples. I'm sorry, but shouldn't the concern here be that someone was about to shoot an apple off my head? Lance, that's our last apple. <laughs> then someone got hit just in time. <laughs> apple you sir! <laughs> oh! oh, come on, I want my apple back. Oh, don't think just because you got horse slobber all over it, I'm not still gonna eat. The caravan! Yep, found it myself. Well, Max helped. <clears throat> Max found it. Sorry, Max. It looks like you two will have to stay here. Don't worry, my lady. I'm great with children. Ha! They're in good hands, Shorty. You're in charge. <laughs> you are 
the princess. I'm in charge. I think you'll find me tough, but fair. <laughs> to have you along, Varian. Plus, I'm hoping once Max and Rediger spend some time together, they can finally become friends. <laughs>